PLC Network here at CES 2025. We're at a new name here. This Now, the company isn't exactly new itself, but it's Correct. new for us because we've never spoken to you before. This is Yarbo, and this is Ken, and it's an awesome company that makes really durable robots. You've seen vacuum cleaners that are robotic. You've seen lawnmowers and other things, pool yep. cleaners, but this is like, this kind of looks more like a lawnmower with muscle. And a, and a snowblower, you, how far does this ecosystem really expand? Yeah, so Yarbo is the world's first uh, modular autonomous yard robot, right? Modular meaning we can take off the snowblower, put on a lawnmower like you mentioned, we can take off the lawnmower, uh, put on a blower, right, leaf blower, um, and then we'll have more modules in the future. So right now we have our smart assist cover, uh, that comes with every Yarbo, so that allows you to do follow me mode. So Yarbo will basically follow you around your yard towing whatever it is you want to tow. So one easy example is firewood, right? Um, it, you just stand in front of it, walk around, and it will tow a dump cart that you buy at Home Depot up to 3,500 pounds. Um, That's actually impressive. That's yeah. very impressive. Yeah, yeah. So the other thing it has is something called tow mode. So you can think of it as like a mini autonomous lawn tractor, right? Anything you would tow with a lawn tractor, you can tow with Yarbo. So let's say you want to tow a leaf sweeper and pick up the leaves, right? You say, I'm towing something four feet wide. I want a one foot overlap between those passes. And it will go and methodically pick up all the leaves on your, lo uh, on your lawn. That is impressive. Yeah, and I like that they're modular. I like the fact yes. that you just have one robot yeah. and they're just attachments. Yeah. So, so so if you have seasonal, you know, conditions like if you're living in Lake Tahoe, yep. you're covering every season for let it be leaves, grass, snow, doesn't matter. Correct. Absolutely. And and there's a couple of special things that had to take place for that. The battery inside Yarbo can self-heat itself. Usually, if Yarbo's designed to stay outside, right? When it's not snowing, if it's negative 30 in Tahoe, um, the problem is lithium batteries freeze and when they freeze they die so we have heating elements actually interwoven into the battery so that was really important we had to figure out also seeing and navigating in the snow all the cameras are heated so there's cameras 360 degrees around Yarbo um, that's so we can detect people and pets so we don't eat them when we snow blow um, so we'll stop we'll say pedestrian or animal detected when they leave the view of Yarbo like 30 feet we'll continue on because we don't want to throw snow at people either right yeah um, um, unless you want to, that's I up mean, to you. Yeah, it could be tempting. It depends on the neighbor. That's true. Yeah, that's true. So mini two-stage snowblower. Um, the other cool thing with this is you can see the auger is actually a few inches in the air, so it works on pavement, concrete, gravel driveways. It also detects on level ground. So typical two-stage snowblowers, you're setting to the highest point of your driveway, so you're not constantly lifting it up on uh, unlevel parts. Yarbo detects level ground and then always scrapes to the bottom, so it makes you can actually see the blacktop when it's done. Um, some other unique things Yarbo is actually modular in the front and new for this year it's modular in the back so you can connect like our granular spreader or our liquid sprayer for like de-icer applications in the winter and uh, fertilizer things like that in the uh, in the summertime so you, you mentioned right ro ro yard robots are really pool um, and lawnmowers now right but we want to like you said cover all seasons right uh, because there's a lot more to even maintaining lawn than just cutting it right it really is yeah air raid uh, you know fat dethatch um, overseed weed treatment all that stuff yeah, except for when you're living in Vegas and you just have dirt. Yeah, that's really it. Right. Some weeds, some right. weeds. But you know, I've I've lived in other areas and I've uh, I, I've witnessed the stress that other people go through in some of these uh, larger country like areas. You know, uh, California. You know, I've I've got some friends in California in the hills and stuff that yep. that are just it's lots of trees, lots of bushes, lots of grass, lots of leaves everywhere. Yep. And of course, they get hit rain, uh, hit with rain and snow in some of those areas, and it's just constant maintenance all yep. year round for them. I mean, this could take so much of that stress away from them. And the price point's really reasonable, too, as well. I was speaking to one of your colleagues about that earlier, and I'm thinking yep. to myself, that price tag's a little high. But when you think about that, you're actually only needing one. That's not for every single function. Exactly. You're just buying the attachments. That changes everything. That makes sense. You, you got it. Yeah. yeah. So Yarbo actually starts at $3,800. That comes with our smart cover, which is like giving eyes, right, and senses to Yarbo. And that'll do that tow mode we talked about, the follow me mode, and the patrol mode. Okay. Um, if you step up from there and do the snowblower, you're looking at about $5,000. If you step up from there and do the snowblower and the lawnmower, which is pretty popular, um, you're talking $6,000. And if you add the blower to it, um, you're talking about $7,000. About $7,000 yeah. if you want all year round protection. Yep. Uh, protection from your achy muscles and uh, <laughs> annoyance 
experiences that just drive you. So anti-anxiety solutions here is what the Yarbo specializes in. So $4,000 pretty much, just sub $4,000 for entry level. Everything moves up from there depending on the needs of the customer. Correct. It's got a good battery? Yeah, it's got a 38 amp hour battery. Uh, and again, it self heats. To give you an idea, the biggest two stage battery powered uh, snow blower, right? Has 20 fam 24 amp hours, so okay. 38 amp hours. Yeah, the lawn capacity, right? It can cover 6.2 acres. Nice. Um, yeah, so it's it's overkill for a lot on the lawn and whatnot, but that's because we need it for the snow blower. Yep, and that's one thing I mentioned with one of your colleagues earlier. I'm like, this is just this is overkill for a lot of yards, but this is for those those robots with muscle. When you got those bigger yards, a lot more space to cover. You know, where those little robots aren't going to make it because they're going to die about an hour Correct. into Correct. it, and you're and barely going to cover anything. Yeah, and you mentioned hills before, so you, the lawnmower can get up a 70% slope. Uh, okay. That's extremely steep. This can get up a 35 degree slope. And the other thing is, some, some people put more of their value in the snowblower because they it do, doesn't matter what it is, they just don't want to go out in the freezing snow, right? Or be worried when a snow surface is going to come around because they don't know when that's going to happen. Yeah. So they'll buy the, the snowblower, and then for a thousand dollars more. They, they got their lawn covered. The other thing we're coming out with this year is a trimmer and edger attachment um, to kind of complete nice. the puzzle. Yeah. Okay. So Minnesota, get ready to call them up and start the orders going because uh, <laughs> they're going to need that. So many other states and cities are going to need this. And uh, where, if, if any of our viewers want to find out more about this, where would they go? So www.yarbo.com. So Y-A-R-B-O. Okay. Y-A-R-B-O. You got it. Dot com. And of course, uh, is there any other outlets that you can find this on, like Amazon or anything else, or is it strictly through Yarbo? It's strictly from Yarbo at the moment. We do have some dealers around that you can find on the website, um, but we do hope to get on Amazon this year. Okay, good. So keep an eye out for that. Uh, for now, Yarbo.com for any of your Yarbo needs. Well, this is really awesome to, to see this, Ken. Thank you very much for taking the time to talk to us about this. Yeah, thank you. And uh, again, if you need to, if you want to find any more information about this, go to Yarbo.com and uh, follow up. Well, Ken, thank you so much. Thank you. Really appreciate it. If you want to stay on top of all the latest and greatest and or at least the gadgets we cover, remember to subscribe right here. Subscription button. Click it. You're going to want to. There's lots of videos, interviews, previews, all sorts of stuff. Button. Click it.